Hello and welcome to Vix Wireless. Today's video is going to be a how to download VLC player for your STR TV to make it run smoother. If you haven't already, mash the like button and subscribe to the channel to help us to grow and share this information with others. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go to your settings and make sure you're connected to your Wi-Fi. And you'll know that you're connected because you'll see the Wi-Fi sign at the top right of the screen there. Next thing you want to do is go to the Google Play Store here in the app section and uh, sign into your Google account if you're not already signed into it. Um, something to keep in mind if you have a Fire Stick, you'll have to go to Downloader and then install a Downloader, um, which will then allow you to install this VLC Player app. Okay, once you get into your Google Store here or your downloader on a Fire Stick, just type in VLC Player and uh, you'll see it pop up here. It looks like a orange caution cone. You'll see it there at the top, VLC for Android. That's actually what we're looking for. Um, once you get it to come up, you're going to click Install and that is going to download to your, uh, your Android device. Um, once it is installed, do not open it you actually just want to go ahead and go back to the home screen just hit the home button and uh, log into your str tv app all right now once you get logged into the str tv got all your credentials put in there um, it'll bring you to your home screen and then at the top here you're going to have a settings jump into there and then we're going to go down to your external players um, you want to make sure you have VLC selected as your external player. I already have it selected in this box. Now let's jump out of here and go to your player selection. And you want your first four options to be selected VLC. Um, normally it'll say built-in player. You want to switch that over to VLC on your first four. You could then go back, back out again, and try and play something. Um, when you jump in and try and play something, it's probably going to load the channels and movies. Keep in mind, you have over 11,000 um, between live channels, movies, and series that's downloading. So the download could take two to three minutes, um, depending on how fast your internet is. From here, um, go in and select a movie, because what it's going to do is it's going to ask you to allow vlc player to uh, actually be used so let's go in here and uh, just select on terminator there we go then we're going to switch over to allow and then uh, if this pops up you can just hit the ok button and you'll be good to go all right everybody if you don't mind make sure to mash the like button and subscribe to our channel so we can continue to grow and share this information with others mm -hmm.